Hello guys, Salty Walty here and third time's the charm. Um, so I'm using the XAML by request from uh, Seraphic Zero. Uh, I'm going to do better, I got to do, well, not in this video, oh, I'm not going to do better, but I absolutely am shit in the XAML. So, um, like, that shot should have hit. Anywho, um, I'm going to, I'm going to practice more on the XAML, I'm just terrible with it. Damn, after doing this three times in a row, I don't know what to say. <laughs> uh, I thought I had it last time, and then uh, Zero corrected me with on something, and so I had to delete the old footage, uh, delete the old video, and upload, uh, and so I'm uploading this one. So, uh, Mazembo is this heavy, uh, heavy support type that is just absolute trash, and it doesn't help that I'm painted all in gold. And the fact that I took all those swings without, uh, without, uh, you know, flinching, it's kind of cool. Uh, my teammates kind of do a, uh, a lazy job of protecting me from the, uh, the, the pixie this match until, like, about a third way in. That's when they get their act together and start keeping the pixie away. Uh... I don't know how to make this ammo good except for make take away its stupid hands it has in this game. In one of the mangas, it's actually giving a uh, pair of standard hands that it would, uh, I've seen, would also carry the 120mm machine gun or the Zaku machine gun. I kind of wish it had that ability in this game because I feel like having just that one machine gun would be much better than those, uh, at least get rid of those lousy ass head Vulcans and give me those, uh, whatchamacallits. I don't know. The Zamble's, uh, I don't know. It's just not my cup of tea. Where'd that shot go off to? Um, I just need, I just need more practice with it. I plan on doing such an act, uh, later on. Just, it's not, to me, a good suit. Uh,. I think round velocity definitely could be upped. It needs to be upped like hard because the round velocity seems rather slow to me. Yeah, you got this big ass shot, but it's also coming from a big ass cannon. And I don't feel like <coughs> that the uh, round velocity is high enough. I, If anything, it's way too low. It should be infinitely higher. It's uh, kind of sad that it's not, honestly. Uh, this thing should be shooting like sniper rifle speeds, I feel like, with every shot. That would make this suit infinitely better right there. Just that change right there. Increase the round velocity of its machine gun, uh, or its cannons, would make this suit so much better. It would be an honest, jo uh, honest joy to use this suit. It would be fun being ag up against it. But now that I got a level 2 uh, G3, I'd like to take one of these bitches on now. Like, how did that shield, uh, like, how did that, like, not damage anybody? Finally hit someone there, but it did, like, piss poor damage. That should have hit, but it didn't. And then I get a Miraculous out of, you know, that's, I think I get, that's my only kill for the entire match. Though I should know by now, considering I've seen this footage about three times in a row. Anywho, uh, I've always wondered, what are those, uh, wing-like, uh, appendages on the XAML? Is that some sort of, a uh, fuel storage? I don't know, maybe the lore knows. I'm gonna have to look it up on the wiki. I don't know, I think those wings are the absolute most ugliest, pointless things on this suit. Now, that's a, that's a suit right there I want, is the mud rock. Uh, man, fuck fighting that in Zionic Front. That thing was a bitch in the first uh, first time you fight it, because none of your suits really have got a lot of good equipment at that point yet. And this is when I finally noticed that I'm uh, completely and utterly surrounded, aka fucked. Uh, the motor rock in Xeonic Front uh, when you first fight it is a it hovers. It's actually no the first form of it, the incomplete form. It still kind of looks like it, but it's without the hovering bits and the extra armor on the shoulders. It still had the 
the arm mounted grenade launchers, but in the Xenic front, they weren't ever used. Uh, and it didn't carry any hand weapons with the exception of a beam saber and its cannons. Fuck those cannons. Uh, hell, even in Xenic front, it didn't have its custom beam rifle. It had the, it could take the, uh, 90 millimeter machine gun and the Gundam's beam rifle. Uh, pretty fun suit to use during simulation uh, play, but having to deal with Agar's voice all the time when playing as Mudrock was trash. Because Mud uh, Agar's trash himself. And I was not a fan of him. He's a little piece of shit. And then get this that little fucker, he ends up being a uh, Titans pilot in one of the mangas. Man, if I was. Uh, I would go out of my way. If I was in Xeon, I would take him on in my Zaku one, and I know I'd win. Because I'm not an overconfident piece of shit who's arrogant as much as bad as he is. I know I'd be able to do my job. Uh, how, let's see, how would I change the Zamel to, ooh, I broke my back. How would I change uh, the Zamel to make it better? Hmm. Give it real arms for one. Give it the, uh, I'd definitely put some shields on. It's not like it's, I'm going to overweigh the thing. I actually would reduce the size of the cannon. Not make it the 660 uh, millimeter that it is. I think it's 660, isn't it? Or is it straight 600 millimeter? I don't remember off the top of my head. But I'd definitely reduce the size of the cannon by like half. Uh, yeah, get the hell out of here. I think I'm not paying attention. Uh, <coughs> reduce the cannon by half. Uh, I would probably move the miss. No, I would keep the missile pod. I probably would double that up because I like missiles. <laughs> double up on the missile pods. Why not? Uh, honestly, I brought this up on I think Sunday or was it with my friends? Uh, when we were just chilling together. Why didn't they just make the Zamel a beam firing suit? That would definitely reduce the amount of weight the suit has by a lot. And then you would also increase speed. You wouldn't have to make the suit as big. Keep the You could keep the cannon size and just make it a really stupidly strong beam cannon. And it's, you, hell, you wouldn't have to reduce the size of the suit if you, you know, you wanted to add more generators and cooling uh, parts to it and you'd have a pretty much long range anti fucking everything suit at that point damn you for taking that I wanted to punch it raptor and no scope pixie fuck you sit down and that's it for that match and I hope you guys have a uh, fantastic night I'm gonna go and enjoy what's the re uh, you know the rest of my birthday so that essentially means sit on my ass and do nothing. And I hope you guys have a fantastic night. I shall talk to you guys later.